So it's been two months or more since I have uploaded a video and I do apologize. I've been really busy um, just with life. Um, but I thought today would be an appropriate day to upload a video and kind of obviously talk about what's in the video, the content itself, uh, talk about Black Ops 4, talk about you know potential updates to the channel, um, which I did want to express because I'm partially excited for it, but partially I'm almost, almost like at the same time, like I don't want to make too many promises and not deliver. Um, so start off by saying what's in the video and what I'm going to be talking about in a, in a, in a few uh, within the video, um, um, this video is not going to be incredibly long, but I do want to cover everything. Um, in the video, basically, I came across an actual hacker. I was playing Black Ops One. I wanted to do, to, you know, to do like kind of like a throwback type of thing where I play like an older Call of Duty, and I thought I would make a like, really cool video and make like a nice comeback video since I haven't uploaded in a while. But I thought, hey, you know what? This is actually, you know, kind of a unique video because I've never came across an actual hacker where I've recorded the actual hacker. You know at, at his finest when he's actually hacking so hopefully you do, you do enjoy the video which is kind of abnormal un, unusual uh that i came across this situation but you know it is what it is i still had fun with it in a way i did report that player because it is a little frustrating that people still do that um so hopefully you do, you do enjoy it and you know, catch what i caught you know the guy was basically like you couldn't see him you could see his um name being lit up um, and by all means, I am not censoring out his name, and I don't care if people, if I had a million people following and people would spam him with hate mail, I would not feel any sympathy or mercy towards that person simply because you ruined the game and you deserve to get people bitch at, bitching at you and potentially even ruining your fucking life because you kind of ruin everyone else's life in the gaming industry by doing shit like that. And unfortunately, obviously, you know, Treyarch and Activision will not you know upkeep you know an older game because it is too much too costly and it's not cost effective so obviously they're not gonna secure one of their older games because what's the fucking point there's not enough people playing that to begin with so it is kind of a sad thing but it happens and you know there's not really much you can do about it just gotta you know block that person so you don't play with that person anymore and hopefully that you know the next a lobby that you play in you know doesn't have any hackers or cheaters in it in an older call of duty you know, if you go even further back in some old even older call of duties you're going to come across a lot of fucking trash when it comes to cheating now i'm going to talk about um channel updates um and then i'll talk about black ops 4 so for channel updates uh, i'm first off i'm not getting black ops 4 i am not um there's nothing in that game that i find appealing uh, i feel like the game is full of shit so i'm not getting it um that's part of the channel update the other thing is i'm going to be co you know covering m most other games i'm still going to do rainbow and i will be uploading a rainbow six siege video later today talking about you know the new updates coming to rainbow but i also wanted to say you know unfortunately i've never really mentioned that i am bilingual and i speak another language uh, obviously i'm you know originally i was born in europe but i came to the united states i don't want to disclose too much information because you know being you know somewhat of a person on youtube you don't want to express too much personal information because you know there's always that fear you never know who's listening or who's watching right um so i you know i like to you know keep my privacy on that level but i do like to engage with people and you know bring my two cents to the gaming community obviously so i am bilingual and i will be uh, making like you know if i make a video uh, a video i will make two different commentaries one in English and one in a different language uh, so that maybe I can you know kind of you know get in point. touch with you know people from you know that part of the world and have fans in that part of the world and have subscribers from that part of the world which would be kind of interesting and I feel like that also would constitute me to be really like a badass and stream on Twitch as well which I could probably do either Friday nights or Saturdays I could probably uh, stream on Twitch and Kind of, you know, do like several hours worth of streaming on Twitch on Saturday. Maybe take a break and then go back to it on Saturday. You know, like, you know, streaming for four hours is kind of a hard and difficult thing to do because you're sitting there, you don't get a chance to eat or really use the toilet or other things. You know, if I stream for four hours on Saturday, take an hour break, come back and stream for another three, I think that would be really, really interesting and cool for me to do. 
Um, obviously, I would stream, you know, occasionally I would stream in, you know, English. Occasionally I would stream, it, you know, in a different language. Obviously, to, you know, get in touch with people from, you know, other parts of the world. Um, so that's uh, a little bit of a channel update. And now just briefly to talk about Black Ops 4 and why Black Ops 4 um, is not a game that I'm getting and what I don't like about it and, you know, the few things that I've noticed that I might like about it, but I still don't want to buy the game. I don't want to spend the $60 and all the other money that you spend on that game just to get, you know, like a decent gaming experience. I'm not spending all that money for no fucking reason, you know. Um, so Call of Duty, I feel like the fact that they're trying to make the game a little bit too tactical, not really something that Call of Duty should be doing. I think it should stay in its arcade Twitch shooting um, genre um, because it's its own like thing. And them trying to be, you know, a little bit more like Rainbow Six Siege with, uh, you know, s special operators of, you know, like different, um, like, you know, you have, you know, you know how you have all, like in Black Ops 3, all these special, uh, you know, like specialists or whatever they're called, um, you know, doing that and then making the game a little bit tactical or trying to make an attempt on making the game tactical really doesn't help your cause and it only kind of makes the game suffer on that level and that's one thing that I don't like about it I also don't like the health system um, the time to kill is so ridiculous that I, obviously it's not a game for me I don't even know with that system are they gonna ha still have hardcore I don't know even if I was to invest in the standard version of the game to actually you know kinda give it a fair shot or I don't wanna pre-order the game to get the beta you know, I mean, I could always do that and then just kind of return it or never just never pay the rest of that and say, fuck it. You know, I could always do that just so I can play the beta and bring you guys some content with the beta. But I don't really even want to waste my time with this game, honestly. Um, obviously, there's, a, you know, just the maps don't look that appealing to me. Um, I feel like it's basically they took Black Ops 3 um, and copied and pasted all the code and they changed the movement system, they changed the score streaks, or they changed the maps a little bit um, and pretty much it's the same game, it's just you don't have wall running or any of that, like uh, you don't have the advanced movement system, you have boots on the ground but you don't have the advanced movement system, but it feels like it's basically the same thing it feels like black ops 3 without the advanced movement system that's all it is based on um you know me reviewing videos of other people re re doing reviews of the game um and obviously these are my personal opinions and i don't have a bias towards the game because I, I i wish the game was good so that i can you know talk about it in a positive light but i can't because you know i've been gaming since the n64 and i know what i'm talking about and this game is fucking trash so I would never recommend anybody to buy this, really, on a personal opinion, like, ba basis. Um, but, I mean, obviously, do what as you please. You know, if you like the game and you want to get it and you want to give it a shot, go for it. But it's not my cup of tea, and I don't plan on playing it. But, anywho, I'm the Mitten. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. Hopefully, hopefully you legitimately enjoyed the actual video in the background because I thought it was kind of a unique little thing. Hopefully you appreciate the channel updates. Uh, I'll keep you guys posted on that with uh you know more information later in a different video and i'm sorry but i'm not getting black ops 4 and i don't want to have anything to do with that franchise anymore because i feel like i've been stabbed in the back way too many fucking times by call of duty and i've been a loyal um pretty much like a patriotic uh fan of call of duty until this point and i feel like i've been betrayed basically but anywho hopefully you enjoyed everything if you did definitely hit that like button definitely leave me a comment let me know what you think leave me some feedback uh, I don't know if I said subscribe, but definitely subscribe if you want more content. I will be uploading uh, more often now. I won't be taking two month breaks from uploading. I will have a little bit more freedom to upload. Most likely, I will be uploading you know during the weekend. You know, maybe one or two videos a weekend. I think that's a good set schedule. I do appreciate the growth as well. I noticed that I have 74 subscribers from yesterday or the day before when I actually checked, and I was initially going to upload a video, but I didn't have enough time. So hopefully, like I said, you enjoyed the video, and uh, I'm the Mitten. That's all I got to say. Peace.